I have an airbag here out of a Mustang for the uh, airbag recall 16S26, the passenger side. Uh, one of the problems here is I'm going to have to disconnect one of these wires and I have to cut it because it has to go through that hole on the end. That white connector is permanent, I can't get it out. When you disconnect one of these, inside of that connector is a bunch of spring-loaded tabs called shorting bars and they're to short the wires together so that any static you build up and handle this thing won't accidentally discharge it. So I'm going to have to strip off some of that uh, white, uh, yellow insulation and put in a shorting bar so I can cut that wire. That way I can handle it safely. Or relatively safely. Now that I have the bar in there, I can cut the wiring. We have the two units side by side now. The old Takata unit has very tiny gas discharge holes in it. With the propellant being corrupted, I guess that's why it builds up so much pressure. The uh, uh, new unit's an auto live unit, much bigger discharge holes. I've slid the auto live unit back in and uh, they give you a new wiring harness unlike the uh, Takata one which the permanent connectors uh, these ones have removable connectors should you ever have to take them out again <laughs> 